The Apostle Paul's greatest desire was to get to know our loving Savior, Jesus Christ, much better. Would you like to know Him? Listen to this devotional. That I May Know Him, a devotional by Ellen G. White. Equality of Believers in Christ. For ye are all the children of God by faith in Christ Jesus. There is neither Jew nor Greek, there is neither bond nor free, there is neither male nor female. For ye are all one in Christ Jesus. Galatians 3, verses 26 through 28. The secret of unity is found in the equality of believers in Christ. The reason for all division, discord, and difference is found in separation from Christ. Christ is the center to which all should be attracted. For the nearer we approach the center, the closer we shall come together in feeling, in sympathy, in love, growing into the character and image of Jesus. With God, there is no respect of persons. Jesus knew the worthlessness of earthly pomp, and he gave no attention to its display. In his dignity of soul, his elevation of character, his nobility of principle, he was far above the vain fashions of the world. He desired not the applause of men. Wealth, position, worldly rank, and all his verities and distinctions of human greatness were all but so many degrees of littleness to him who had left the honor and glory of heaven and who possessed no earthly splendor, indulged in no luxury, and displayed no adornment but humility. The lowly, those bound with poverty, pressed with care, burdened with toil, could find no reason in his life and example which would lead them to think that Jesus was not acquainted with their trials, knew not of the pressure of their circumstances, and could not sympathize with them in their want and sorrow. The lowliness of his humble, daily life was in harmony with his lowly birth and circumstances. The Son of the infinite God, the Lord of life and glory, descended in humiliation to the life of the lowliest, that no one might feel himself excluded from his presence. He made himself accessible to all. He did not select a favorite few with whom to associate and ignore all others. All men are of one family by creation, and all are one through redemption. Christ came to demolish every wall of partition, that every soul may have free access to God. His love is so broad, so deep, so full that it penetrates everywhere.